So he came home and he was like, you know, babe, I lost my job. I'm like, all right, cool. So a month later, like the bills, it was time for the bills or whatever, you know? And I'm like, you know, the bills do, babe, or whatever. And he was like, okay, you know, I'm not working. And, and I'm just, in a month, like it's all kind of hustles. You could have been doing something or whatever. So I told him, I said, look, if I pay these bills, are you going to pay me the money back? This man had the nerve to tell me, why should I pay my wife back for, for paying our bills? I told this man from day one, my money is my money and his money is our money. Why should I spend my money paying the bills? Like, no, he should have paid me back. So that's when I decided, like, I can't be with this man no more. So I had Texas homeboy. Like, we all cool. I Texas homeboy or whatever. You know, we went together. We, we got, we left. We, I met up with him. And we was, you know, we was chill, we was chilling, we were drinking or whatever. And I started venting. I started venting, you know, like I started getting emotional. One thing led to the next. I did not purposely mean to do what I did with this. But things happen. Things happen. Like, y'all understand what I'm going through. So, you know, his friend ended up giving me some money or whatever. And he was like, you know, babe, look, don't worry about it. Do handle whatever you got to handle. Like, his friend was every single thing I desire in a man. Like, everything I desire in a man. And, you know, ain't nobody trying to hear my So let me know what you think about this situation. But for me, I find it very interesting because it offers us a window into female nature and male nature. So let's dive into it. Number one is that women have a preference. So this girl was clearly attracted to this guy because obviously the guy had some money he had some status and women love these kind of things now the moment all these things are stripped away from the guy why would we expect her to continue sticking to the guy even though the things that initially attracted her to this guy are gone imagine this scenario you are attracted to this beautiful woman you have a good time and then in the morning you find out oh it was all makeup and when you see her without makeup she is terrifying just because you are attracted to her initially because of the makeup that she had do you really think it's wrong for you to leave her now because you have already seen her without the makeup i think this is the same same scenario with this guy the girl saw the guy with the makeup the makeup being the guy had money he had status and now she has seen the guy without the makeup so is it wrong for her to move on to the next best thing that she actually finds attractive so that's my point women have a preference and the things that initially attracted her to the guy if they are temporary then her being with this guy should not be permanent it should be temporary also this is the same this is this is just logic number two is that women are selfish and they put themselves first now think of it in terms of human nature women will always put themselves first regardless of what you what goes on women will always put themselves first and it's because if she survives then there is a very high probability that her kids will survive and so that's the point now she said clearly in the video that she had stated your money is our money my money is my money and if she told you if she was truly honest with you then the moment you don't have your money you should be expecting nothing because she's already told you this is the situation but the, my, the money that my mother makes is hers and the money that my father makes is for both of them and that's the point and that is I think that is the traditional role of the masculine man to provide if a woman starts paying bills for one month two months three months five months it won't work it won't last one year a hundred percent especially if she was attracted to you because you had that resource security number three is that women are emotional and the emotions need to be led so this girl goes to the friend of the guy the guy is a masculine man what do you expect when a woman is led by a masculine man obviously she's going to submit and guys this is the secret to actually banging women it 
the burning part needs to be emotional it needs to be like it's a whole different universe or a whole different yeah a whole different universe when in that moment and then later when she she's thinking about what the fuck did i just do it's like okay i was not in control of that moment and so she can she can blame the situation and and that is how casual hookups work like you need to be exciting you need to get her out of the normal state and excite her into a new state where she just goes with the flow and then now later is when she realizes oh man that was fun i'd like to do that again but also what the fuck did i do that's the point and so the point is that women are emotional and a man who can lead a woman then she will submit to him truly and that is what happened here well i don't know if that's truly what happened this is a, this is just my own opinion and i'm open to criticism and then lastly women will always be attracted to men who are better than them so think of this situation the reason why she left this guy is because now she thinks she is better than the guy the guy was providing the guy was you know the guy was financially secure and so this is what made this woman look at this guy on a different light because the guy was somehow better than her so she could look up to him but now the guy is looking up to the woman to pay the bills so this makes no sense like how do you expect her to be attracted to you when you are looking up to her and so women will always be attracted to men who seem to be better than them and it doesn't have to be like you are doing better than her there is a reason why losers who live uh, in the basement of their parents still get women and it's because of the way they are perceived this is a game of perception and so if she perceives that you are better than her it doesn't matter if reality is wrong she will still be attracted to you and so the other guy obviously is now more attractive to her because now the guy compared to this other guy the other guy is far much better and if she compares herself to this guy this guy obviously is better than her and this is all nature so uh, uh, there are some things that are just hardwired in us and we cannot change them we just have to accept them and so my point is that this woman did no wrong she's a woman she was truly in her feminine when she was doing all these things as men we should take responsibility for whatever happens if she leaves us it's all on us if she stays with us it's all on us that's my takeaway we bear the responsibilities of everything that happens in our lives